We want to take a look at one trending ticker on this Monday morning. Take a look at shares of Peloton down over 3%. The Financial Times reporting earlier uh, today that the new CEO, that's Barry McCarthy, keep in mind they just had a a change in leadership last week. The new CEO saying that he wouldn't move across the country if he was going to sell the company. He's going to be moving to New York for this new job. He said, quote, there are lots of other things I could be doing with my time that are quite lucrative than hanging out with a business that's about to be sold. So the new head there, perhaps throwing some cold water onto the uh, optimism among some circles that maybe Apple or Amazon or a Nike will be interested in buying them. And Akiko, still important to note that John Foley, the uh, CEO of the past, uh, still has a huge say. He's going to be executive chair. Well, and Barry McCarthy in that interview with the Financial Times makes it pretty clear he's going to continue to turn to him, too, as they try to get this company back on the right track. You know, those comments coming from him, not entirely a surprise, I would say, last week uh, when we he was tapped for the top position. I think a lot of analysts sort of looked at that and said, OK, maybe a sale in the future, but that's not going to happen immediately if they're bringing a big name executive on board. So that seems to jive with the comments that he's putting out there. Having said that, um, you know, don't expect him to necessarily disclose a sale to the FT in an interview. I, I think I would argue it's probably still in the works. Uh, Peloton has said, you know, in their most earnings, most recent earnings call that they are looking at all options because they realize they've got a. Uh, you know, definitely improve in terms of cost cutting, but also uh, make the platform a little stickier so they keep those uh, users on board. So uh, there's a lot in the works here, and I, I'm not sure a, a sale is in the immediate future, but interesting to see the the stock reaction tonight. Yeah, really poignant observation there. I mean, you know, if you're a new CEO and your first interview to a media outlet, you're saying things like, well, oh, yeah, of course we're going to sell. I mean, you would never do that, even if you were having those discussions. So I think that when it comes to just uh, the optics here, we have to keep in mind that even though he's saying we're not going to explore a sale, I mean, of course, uh, there's always a chance of anything. That's how Wall Street goes. So uh, it, it, an ongoing story for sure. Keep in mind, shares of Peloton still down 70% over the last six months, so still a lot of turnover uh, story there, regardless of merger or new uh, turn in leadership.